Welcome my friends, we're recording and why does it show radio player every time I record? It's because I have to hit control shift R to get it to record and it brings up the radio. And same thing when I want to get rid of the lag, I have a feature for the lag, control shift L so the lights come on. Anyway, it's just about two o'clock Saturday afternoon we're trucking. It's 12.24 a.m. game time on a Sunday. And I'm not watching college football, okay? So I'm making a video. You might get a little echo because I'm still sorting out this audio. I bought one of them black web desktop microphones from Walmart. I guess it's a good microphone, but trying to get it right ain't working out so then where I just delivered a load there was a wall blocking me to back into the garage uh, I'll put up some pictures so I shut the game off, went out, did some errands, came back, turned it on. Now the truck is half under the wall and half sunk into the ground. So I had to call a tow truck and it cost me almost $13,000. It's kind of short shift in here. Anyway, we're on our way. We're going to pick up an oversize today. We're only doing like, a, come on, truck, 357 miles, I think it is. Just nothing wants to cooperate today. I had this truck up to 107 earlier. 106, 107, 8, 9, 10, 11. Come, we gotta get off of this exit. Uh -oh. That's happened to me a lot too. Tap the brakes and I lose the steering. So I drove this truck this morning and crashed it three times already. It's a new truck. Problems, problems, right? Ain't the end of the world though, it's just a game. It's a toy. I was just here not too long ago to get fuel. This is the MH Pro deal. They got a repair shop that he changed. And you can pick up loads here. I wish he would move the fences. I don't know why he's got dumpsters over here. Go ahead, bro. Yeah, that came with the truck. That came with the truck. Anyway, I'll show you the truck in a few. But I picked up a trailer here, a low boy, earlier, earlier today. And it says I was carrying a tractor at 48,000 pounds. There was no tractor on the back of the low boy. So you figure it. I got paid anyway. All right, earn money. I need money. We're gonna go from Flagstaff to Socorro. 357, supposed to take a little over six hours. There may be a little echo feedback on this mic. You know, I'm doing what I could do. Yeah, that is annoying. I 
I mean, with all that space back there, he had to jam this stuff in here. It's a car alarm, I know. But when I went to accessories, I couldn't find a change the bumper node thinking that changing the rear of the bumper would change the tone. All right, what do we get here? 55,000 pound crawler for 30,000. So you figure, what we say, 350 miles, you divide that into your 30,000 if it's worth taking the trip. Sometimes some freight ain't worth taking. Now if we can get out of here without taking a fence down, we'll be doing real good. So how are you spending your Saturday afternoon? Oh, we got a street light right here. Let me block up the street. Look at this. It's a freight liner and a paint job. Wobbly antennas. See inside. This was sent to me for free because I had purchased trucks from this modder before. So after he redone this mod, since it was not his originally, he, he improved it or made changes to it and gave it out for free and gave credit to the original modder which is I think is okay with me I prefer to pay for a mod from the originator and I really don't like mod hackers they you know but there's so many people on there they go how can I get that for nothing let me educate you you do not ever get anything in life for nothing okay and with that you also get any additional updates that come along so it's pretty nice it had a pretty good selection of paint jobs I went with the flames black and flames and I don't know if there was a fourth axle I mean the lift axle pretty nice headache rack that's the XL classic So I have a Freightliner cab over, the Harvin edition, and I got a hood. It's got a big motor in it, over a thousand horsepower. I think it's 1,040. See, we take out the fence. Now, why couldn't they move the fence? I ain't gonna get out of this parking lot without taking something out. If it's supposed to be for a challenge, it's ridiculous because it's nothing but aggravation. Like I told you, I already own a CDL. I don't need any additional aggravation. Oh good. Let me uh, go the wrong way in a one-way street because I'm talking. I had backed up earlier out of that same garage and hit a police car. I pushed him to the side. He had like a blazer. Why are they making me do this loosely? Look at that. <laughs> there you go. Once we take out this other sign. Crunch. Take them all down. Alright, I'm going the wrong way. I know I'm going the wrong way. You make a mess out of this, boy. I'm gonna 
put 10 miles on before I even get where I need to be. Can't go left. Dude, stop. Look at that. Okay, stay where you were. Remember, I'm automatic, so I don't shift too good. Did you hear the sound between shifts? That's cool. Yeah, I would like to have had the fourth axle. Next time I get into the repair shop, I got 200 grand. Paying for damages and whatnot. These short ramps. Nobody's coming. Here we go. scenery. I'm already got a complaint. The billboards. Okay, it's nice to have billboards. It's got about 900 of them. He needs to get rid of about 800 of them. They're everywhere. Look at these guys stopping. Come on there. What's that? Coca-Cola? Get on it. I mean, I was out in Arizona, New Mexico, and there were billboards in the middle of no stinking wear. I mean, it was, it was, it actually ruined the scenery to me. Actually ruins it because it's, you don't need it, see? You got a Napa over there. Now, he changed these signs over the highway signs. They're round instead of square. I don't think that means a whole bunch. Rolling at 65 ish, and we got something here ish. That barricade, I hate that thing. Another breakdown. Yeah, so, um, 
don't have too many complaints with the game so far other than that last delivery I made where it was a wall blocking the garage door where I was supposed to back in to unload which I couldn't so I had to lose my 40 points then when I shut the computer off then I came back a couple hours later turned it on and my truck was underneath the concrete uh, wall and sunk down into the ground only the hood and the, and the front tires were sticking up I was like how am I going to get out of this so I had to hit F7 paid $350 for a tow truck, got to the tow shop, $1,300 for repairs. I was like, you know, why are you taking out of my pocket? I didn't do nothing. So that last load I did pretty much was zero. So if you're new to the game, when I first got on the game, it was at 1.34. I'm still having PTSD withdrawal symptoms because of that. I'm not kidding. I didn't take a bank loan. I got up to $850,000. I had two trucks, two trailers, two shops. And then it went to 1.35 and crashed everything. And oh my God, I had to start all over again. And I didn't have a bunch of mods. Now I got a pile of them. So, um,. changes over and over and over but I made my money because you get a uh, achievements if you cover every city in the state you get an achievement if you run all the highway miles in that state you get an achievement you know what I'm saying it was just things to, to get you didn't, that's all it was just achievements so I wind up Every load I took, short runs, short haul. See all the billboards? I mean, it's too many. And we're in the middle of nowhere. Come on, car. Too many billboards, and they're huge. We got Target. Target, I think he included in this game, in this uh, mod. And IKEA. There was a few more. anyway so I made a lot of money and I got a bunch of achievements from Arizona then New Mexico DLC and then it ran all over Nevada it ran all over California and then you, you, you knock them out you, your achievements that you that they have they uh, you'll see them in the beginning of the game but yeah then you had to start all over again when the game crashed to 1.35 oh well and if it comes out 1.36, it's going to be all over again. Well, you know what? I'm busy talking and I blew right by my exit. My goodness. What the yuck. Man. I wasn't looking at the screen. I was looking at the road. <laughs> oh, man. Make a lousy truck driver, don't I? Now I got to get off. So busy just cruising. You and me, we cruising. Yeah, my uncle taught me how to drive long many years ago. And then after so many years, we got into, you know, just a short discussion about the truck business. And I told him, I said, I hate the trucking industry. <laughs> truck business sucks. Look at this. Come on, truck. Now what? Oh, we can go backwards, but we ain't going forward. We're in first gear now. Come on. Go, truck. Go. All right, check this out. Brakes on. Brakes off. in the crash. Come on 
now. This ain't good. If you were ever on an icy hill with an 18 wheeler, this is about time when you clean out your underwear. Bigger motor? Ain't this something? Yep, we're gonna crash for sure. Another reason why I blow red lights and stop signs on these hills. And all the traffic on the other side is slowing down to watch me. You fixed the crash. <clears throat> Man. Come on. We're in low gear. I ain't got no more gears. Got the brake on. got two pedals brake and gas so that was the problem if I step on the brake I can't get gas uh, throttle that makes any sense well we didn't lose it that's what my uncle used to tell me when I was driving I said how did I do he said did you hit anything I said no so then you did good. Here without me hitting something. Do I need to get off yet? <laughs> well, that would have been messed up. We're in Holbrook. Let me get back in the cab here. See? Embarrassing. Oh my god. Red light, as usual. Can't go to the right. Almost 7.20 a.m. Sunday morning. Where's all this traffic coming from? Okay, the bus got to get right in the way. That's me too heavy on the throttle, but I'm trying. Shift. 
I didn't know I had it if locked. Yeah, if you do download this uh, MHA Map Pro here, he has a long list of mods that he made. It was cities and towns and all sorts of stuff. They redid a couple of whole towns. I just don't remember the whole list. Trains. All right, why'd the car move? interior yeah we it was uh he had a number of different colored interiors to go in here i didn't spend a whole lot of time going through every single accessory because i just wanted to get on the road but essentially i like it the way it is coming up to show low coming up to almost 30 minutes on the bid why they give me a bypass? I got oversized. Don't be giving me this bypass. I'm going down this way anyway. What the heck with them? And you get the red light. Turn, Cloud. See what I was saying is a billboard here, there's another billboard there, and it kind of takes away from the scenery, is what I'm saying. I don't know. You know, in the city, or close to the city, you expect to see numerous billboards. But when you get out here, he's kind of spaced out like in intervals, you know, and I'm just like, I don't think I really need them. Especially the mostly hamburger video um, billboards. This guy's name is Heavy Alex, I don't know, you know what I'm saying? Billboards for everyone, okay. Don't need them all the way out here like this. primary example what I just was trying to explain that really didn't need to see that and it takes away from the other features the old broke down container in the middle of nowhere
thought I saw a fighter jet go by, but I don't never hear uh, never hear a uh, sound pack. There goes that stinking cement truck. At least they should make it in different colors, you know. Yeah. Okay, I heard that one. Did you hear that one? When the jets go by, I never hear a jet motor. Got it. This is a novel idea to have in these rest areas. But you do get to see other trucks like on display, which I think that's pretty cool. That airplane ought to swoop us again. And get off as well. Heard him that time. Still got 128 miles to go. Oh, a billboard, look at that. Some bunky. Well, to me, on my TV screen, I got a high sense. I probably don't have my resolution right. When I go in the garage, I have a TV in the garage. It's a bigger screen TV. And then the, the resolution looks a lot better. And uh, I will be downloading the JBX Weather. I, did, I sent money to them. And he sent me the files. But I haven't downloaded it. I'll do it later today, this evening. They, they have recommended graphic settings to go with, with his software program there. So, uh, if, you, if it looks kind of washed out to you and there's like no sky, you know. So, we'll see what kind of pop we get with the new JBX work boot warehouse. And trucks parked to the side. Which, like I said, if it was a little restaurant there or a diner or something, that would be rural America. That'd be cool, you know. Just pretty much the way it is across rural America. Mom and pop restaurant. Get some good biscuits and gravy. Let me get my head back inside here. Hurry up, slow down. Hurry up, slow down. Another rest area. Oh, Club Cafe. I don't know what that means. It came with the. <laughs> it came with a mod that I downloaded. I don't know what. That Yeah, yeah. Why are you stopping, man? Ah, oh, God. So I tell you, this game don't do nothing but stop you. Butthead could have went faster and turned. What we got over here? Police car? Got him a desperado. I didn't mean to do that. I really hate when I do that. I meant to do that. I don't hate, it just aggravates. See the switches in the middle of the dashboard? That cracks me up. <laughs> Let's see. Lights. Right. I mean, that's pretty cool. Hit 
the police car, will you? I got 50 miles left with 35 minutes into the bid. I'm at 46, somewhere around there, FPS. And I'm glad you came along for the ride. Watching my truck handling. How many things did I hit so far? Billboards, middle of nowhere. Yep, I knew that was going to happen. Where's my map? One lane. Come on, they're already after me for being late. Exxon, get out of the way. Yeah, let's cheat. Okay, they're empty truck. Can't get over 60. It's a dirt road. Take out the sign. <laughs> Where's the front door to this dump? Back there. Backing this bad boy up. Come on. Straight ahead, twenty five. Here we go. Yep. that landing gear late come on it took only three hundred seventy nine dollars well, I got paid thirty thousand out of it we're right at 40 plus seconds thanks for hanging with me see you later make a comment See you next time. Bye.